Welcome friends and observers of innovation in the automotive industry. My name is Freddy Geier. I'm the CEO of Rightware and I'm excited to announce our new tool, which is a step change for the automotive industry. A tool that will make it easier than ever for automakers to delight their customers with a superior in-car user interface. The development of our new tool was influenced by the latest innovations we will see inside of cars. The intelligent cockpit will be the new normal. More and bigger screens determine the customized interior of each new car model. Everywhere we see perfectly fitted digital instrument clusters, head-up displays and high-resolution touchscreens. They are connected to the complex electronic nervous system of the vehicle, which is equipped with the most powerful computers. But every smart dashboard in a car is only as good as its user interface. So what to expect from a modern car these days besides a reliable instrument pen? The IVI, which today is a simple control center, becomes the stage for favorite user applications. Nicely designed widgets and information snippets find their way into the car seamlessly to keep the driver up to date. Enjoying a personal music playlist will be an even better experience in this driving cocoon. The infotainment system serves as a communication center that ensures safe calling and hands-free operations. And all of this is smoothly controlled by voice or by touch. Never have there been greater possibilities to delight drivers and passengers with user interface design. Even changing car settings can be an aesthetic experience. What was only a picture in a manual becomes a stunning interactive infographic blended seamlessly into the UI that simplifies control over the exterior and interior of the vehicle. And it doesn't end there. In a modern vehicle, up to 100 sensors generate about 25 gigabytes of data every hour. All this data is continuously evaluated and needs to be presented appropriately to make driving safer and more convenient. A car HMI is a master of data visualization, increasing the driver's confidence in how the vehicle sees its surroundings. Advanced visual assistance enable more control and give smarter advice. We call it the sixth sense of a vehicle made obvious to the driver. What was a simple map becomes a unique navigation app, matching the overall style of the interface. It shows you not only your way through unknown terrain, but also weather conditions, buildings, traffic data and other real-time information. One thing is clear, the next generation of automotive HMIs will be built with multiple screens, large screens, high resolution screens. And we believe it is thoughtful functionality and great design from the exterior to the interior and all the way to the digital user interface that gives car brands a competitive edge and drives brand loyalty. We want to transform what was formerly regarded as just a cluster of instruments behind the steering wheel into a real signature UI that is unique and true to its brand. Today, we are enabling even more outstanding user experiences with Kansi One, our new and the most capable HMI software framework for the automotive industry. Kansi One guarantees production-proven robustness and functional safety compliance. Take that for granted. Kanso is also known for the most efficient development workflow, which we further improved in this new version. But what inspires car manufacturers the most is the freedom to create beautiful visualizations, which are flawlessly rendered by the most capable automotive-centric graphics engine. 
Now, let's go live to Helsinki to learn more about our new incredible tool, which will change design and development of modern multi-display connected cockpits from the ground up. I would like to introduce you to Taro Koivo, our Chief Strategy Officer. He will share all highlights about Kansi One. Taro, the stage is yours. Thanks, Freddy. I'm proud to unveil what we have been working on here at Rightware for quite some time. Today, we are announcing something great, something quite unique, in fact, something astonishing, Kansi One. Kansi One is the perfect tool chain for modern HMI development. It comes with everything you need to develop your next generation HMI project. Kansi One includes the well-known core Kansi Studio and Kansi Engine, and all of our feature packs, including Kansi Connect, Kansi Maps, Kansi Particles, and Kansi Auto Stereoscopy. We also have a brand new feature pack that I will introduce later. With Kansi One, you can develop advanced multi-OS, multi-display user interfaces, leveraging all the benefits of a service-oriented architecture, integrating deeply with the Android automotive ecosystem and creating groundbreaking, forward-looking visualizations that will make your brand truly stand out. Your own signature UI. Let me introduce some of the biggest improvements we are rolling out with Kansi One. In this September's beta release, we have focused on three major, very important technology areas. Rendering, Android and the UI framework. Let's start with number one, rendering, the main pillar for creative graphics. We have completely renewed our rendering pipeline, allowing developers to leverage physically based HDR rendering in their UI projects. For those who are fans of advanced 3D graphics, many new built-in features are available. Dynamic soft shadows, real-time reflections, environment and image specializing, hits DR support, tone mapping, and much more. On the post-processing side, we are bringing true cinematic effects like bloom, vignette, chromatic operation, and depth of field. With such advanced graphics, you can create an even better perception of luxury and quality in the cockpit. Secondly, we have added built-in support for the GLTF file format. This puts hundreds of thousands of ready-made models at your fingertips and makes it virtually seamless to import high-quality 3D content into Kansi projects. These improvements make it super easy for developers to achieve stunning, state-of-the-art rendering quality with minimal effort. They bring Kansi's rendering capabilities to the same level offered by modern game engines today but targeted specifically for automotive UI use. Most importantly, we target embedded platforms and our lightweight runtime ensures that we use minimal system resources. Kansi One is fully scalable from low-end platforms all the way to the highest performance state-of-the-art SOCs. Number two, Kansi One is designed to work with Android. As we all know, Android Automotive is one of today's hottest topics. In the past few years, we have designed Kansi to be fully compatible with Android ecosystem and to provide a fully seamless workflow to enrich Android applications. We have basically renewed Kansi's architecture to provide a unique level of added value for the Android ecosystem and build best-in-class tools for application developers. We added support for, for multiple programming languages and the first new language we are announcing today is Java. This makes application development on Android-based systems as streamlined as it can get. How is this? First, you can use Android Studio to develop applications and plugins using either Java or Kotlin. Second, it eliminates the lines of code needed by over 50% compared to working with other tools. This is truly a game changer. No glue code, no custom work, just ease of development. 
Another way we are making life easier for Android developers is by enabling free composition between Android and Kansi. You can mix Android views and Kansi views in any way you want. This makes it super easy for developers to leverage high quality graphics in otherwise traditional Android applications. It's the best of both worlds. You can freely choose the right tool for the use case. We have also added support for running third-party applications inside the Kansi application, enabling seamless composition in both 2D and 3D space. Developers can now project and run fully interactive Android applications on top of any 3D surface. Imagine a standard Android application running on a surface of your 3D car model. This delivers an extra level of freedom in how you design your next HMI. Finally, Kansi One ships with a set of valuable real-life examples to get you off to a rapid start with your Android project. These include ready-made integration with Android Car APIs, a modular multi-process launcher application, and more. These examples provide a great starting point for creating your own signature UI. To summarize, we enable creative graphics advanced visualization and state-of-the-art UX on platforms based on Android Automotive. Although it remains cross-platform, Kansi One is in a class of its own when it comes to deep integration with Android. It's the first and only toolchain designed to be fully compatible with Android ecosystem. Finally, number three workflow and efficiency improvements to the UI framework. Automotive software projects and HMIs are getting much more complex. And we want to make your life easier. In this latest release, we are bringing the concept of an activity system to Kansi One. Activities, as we call them, will change how you develop your next HMI. When building modular, feature-rich UI applications, Activities allow you to structure your projects in smaller UI parts. This makes it much easier and more manageable to develop advanced automotive projects. Also, for the first time ever, developers can now inject code snippets directly into the UI tree in Kansi Studio. This brings a new workflow to those UI developers who are more programming oriented who can now more easily add functionality to UI elements and to customize their behavior. From the performance perspective, acti activities bring major improvements to resource handling on more complex UI projects. Now, entire UI parts can easily be virtualized, reducing memory usage, CPU load, and overall loading times in the system. And all of this is automated by default, reducing development time needed while delivering a performance boost. This has always been one of our ultimate goals, helping you to do better, faster. Now, something I promised earlier. I want to announce a brand new productivity enhancer, Kansi VR. Developing and validating multi-display cockpits is becoming a complex job for everyone. We are lowering the barrier with our latest offering, Kansi VR. The Kansi VR feature pack makes it easy to test and validate your design in an early phase, even when you don't have access to physical displays or a dashboard model. A Kansi Studio project can contain virtual interior of the car in development, integrating live HMI screens from other Kansi Studio projects on the same computer or on the same network, or even directly from an actual automotive hardware platform running a production quality UI. Kansi One is already the natural choice for HMI development on all operating systems, in the car and for all automotive use cases. Now, concepting, prototyping and validating the entire in-car UX can easily be done within the same tool. Kansi One is truly an all-in-one HMI tool chain, allowing automotive manufacturers and tier ones to develop signature UIs for their next generation intelligent cockpits with a completely new 
yet unimagined UX. Back to you, Freddy. Thank you for that product introduction, Taro. This is very, very exciting. Today, we also would like to invite you to join our beta program for CANSI 1, which will be available starting September 15th. Visit rightword.com to learn more about CANSI 1 and contact our sales team to inquire about participating in the beta program. Don't wait too long, beta seats are limited. We hope you got a useful glimpse into the future of developing car HMIs. Thank you very much for attending today's event. See you at CES with the release of Kansi 1 and the latest news from Rightware.